Hi everyone, Jim O'Brill here with Drive Chicago. Today we're taking a look at the Toyota Tacoma. This truck dates back to 1995 and is currently in its third generation, which debuted in 2015. It received a mild refresh in 2020 and from 2021 going into the 2022 model year remains relatively unchanged with the exception of a new trail edition model and a more advanced and lifted TRD Pro model that will come in lime green. The Tacoma is available in seven different trim levels with two powertrains and a mix of cab and bed sizes. Prices range from a starting price of $26,500 for a two-wheel drive Tacoma all the way up into the $40,000 range for top-level models. Let's hop in and take a closer look at the Toyota Tacoma. The new Tacoma continues as a body-on-frame truck that's offered as a four-passenger access cab with a 6.1-foot bed or as a five-passenger double cab with a five-foot bed and four full doors. The seven trim levels are SR, SR5, TRD Sport, TRD Off-Road, Limited, Trail, and TRD Pro. The SR and SR5 come standard with a 2.7-liter four-cylinder engine that makes 159 horsepower with 180 pound-feet of torque, mated to a six-speed automatic. All other models come standard with a 3.5-liter V6, making 278 horsepower and 265 pound-feet of torque, mated to either a six-speed automatic or six-speed manual. All trucks come with either rear or part-time four-wheel drive. Having spent my time in a V6, I found that it delivered ample power and acceleration, with the overall ride feeling somewhat sporty. It also provided greater capability with a towing capacity of 6,400 pounds and payload of 1,155 pounds. Tires and suspension will greatly influence the ride, and the TRD off-road model provided a fairly bouncy and noisier ride on the highway. It still remained controlled and stable, but with looser steering at higher speeds. The available TRD Performance Exhaust gave it a deeper exhaust tone that sounded really good. The Tacoma really shines off-road with features such as an electronic locking rear differential, multi-terrain select, hill start assist control, crawl control, skid plates, and multi-terrain monitoring system. The multi-terrain select offers five modes including mud and sand, loose rock, mogul, rock and dirt, and bigger rock. The system is intuitive and easy to use. Standard ground clearance is a respectable 9.4 inches, and off-road performance shocks from both Bilstein and Fox are tuned by Tier D engineers and available on off-road spec models. All models come with the appropriate skid plates to protect the undercarriage of the truck so that you can take this truck off the pavement. The styling remains relevant with a rugged design well suited for personal modification. The front grille will vary based on trim models with a Toyota emblem in the center. But both the new Trail Edition and TRD Pro models feature the Toyota Heritage inspired grille with Toyota spelled out across the center. The front fascia sits high for the ground clearance and both front corners slant upwards to aid with departure angles. The side profile features flared fenders with plenty of room for a variety of tire sizes. And a round back Tacoma is stamped into the tailgate. Most trucks will come with projector beam headlights, but LEDs are available on the Limited and TRD Pro models. Wheels range in size from 16 inches up to 18 inches in a variety of styles and finishes. The designs were updated in 2020 and include finishes such as black, dark gray, bronze, and machined alloys. The interior is simple and functional, but looks tough and ready to get dirty. The overall build is quality is top-notch with durable materials and tight gaps. Drivers will face a traditional cluster setup with an available 4.2-inch information screen in the middle. Either a 7 or 8 inch touchscreen is in the middle of the dashboard with navigation buttons and knobs surrounding it. The system integrates with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Amazon Alexa, but operation lagged a bit and it did feel a little bit dated. All of the controls are well placed and straightforward. Off-road multi-terrain controls are placed within the headliner, which is atypical but also easily within reach. The center stack features a traditional gear shifter, multiple cup holders, wireless mobile device charging, and a center console storage. Since the Tacoma's ride is a little bit higher, it will require more effort to get in. Power adjustable seats are on most grades, which help the driver positioning as the seats are mounted low to the floor. The seats are comfortable and there is sufficient head and leg room up front. Rear passenger space is tighter but not terrible. Tucked under the rear seats are some small but usable storage compartments. Additionally, the seats fold forward to provide a flat surface. It also comes standard with a removable tailgate and bed rail system with adjustable tie-downs. Toyota Safety Sense P is standard on all trucks and includes pre-collision system with pedestrian detection, high-speed dynamic radar cruise control, 
lane departure alert, and automatic high beams. Also standard is the STAR safety system, which includes vehicle stability control, traction control, anti-lock braking system, electronic brake force distribution, brake assist, and smart stop brake override technology. The Tacoma has become a benchmark in the mid-sized truck segment that is proving to stand the test of time. It's a true truck with plenty of capability off-road and all the basic modern technology needed on-road. It holds its value extremely well and is consistently among the top value holding vehicle lists, retaining around 72% of its resale value after five years. Consistently a bestseller, this truck is definitely one to consider. That's a wrap of my review of the Toyota Tacoma. I've always been a fan of Toyota trucks and SUVs and the Tacoma is no different. I love how versatile this truck is for both on-road and off-road, and I'm still a fan of the style even though it's been around for a bit. For the full review, you can visit drivechicago.com or for more automotive content, be sure to subscribe below or check out our other social channels on Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram. I'm Jim O'Brill with Drive Chicago. Thanks for watching.